Alrighty guys, in today's video, we're going to be looking at something to keep in mind about when you're working with text. And this will be for TrueCut already works. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.co.za. We make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise, we head back in the program here. Now, just a quick reminder, this is a mini series on tips and tricks, and I will leave relevant links in the description so you guys can follow along. So now in today's video, we're going to be looking at editable, editable text, <laughs> my apologies, and then something to keep in mind when you're working with a grouping and ungrouping feature. So by default, if you have your text selected and you double click it, you can edit your text. So let's make that test text two, just so you can see there we've got it. But now something to keep in mind, which you might do is let's say you want to rearrange the text letters. Then you go to your ungroup option here on top, click that. Now we've got individual little letters so we can move it around, maybe scale it. You know, we can do all kinds of fun things with it or fun things with it. Move that too and maybe bring this in a bit. So then uh, now what we do is we go we group it back again clicking the middle group button and there you go we've got a text but now you will notice if you double click this no longer or well, the text is no longer able to be edited so that is something you must keep in mind you might by accident do that and wonder what's happened and then you break your text so i would say if you're going to make changes it's always good practice you can simply just keep controlling with your text selected click on it drag and drop make a copy of it or select it and go control c control v before you do editing so if you want to do custom changes like this i would say it's a good idea just go somewhere off the canvas leave your copy there because it will be outside the cutting area and then uh, as you guys can see i've got quite a few things at my bottom that i leave as bookmarks in case i need to use them so yeah, so that is it on editable text. Just something to keep in mind. If you've ungrouped it and you regroup it, you will no longer be able to edit it with your normal text tool. Otherwise, if we head to the website softwaretraining.co.za, you guys will notice we've got a variety of different softwares we do cover. And also you can isolate your search on the top right. If you do not, however, find the training videos you're looking for, just go here, request the training video, fill in the mini form, uh, let us know for what software it is and then we'll try to do our best to make that video for you but otherwise thanks guys for watching and cheers